So here are some really cute zebra tip printed nails here. I'm gonna be showing you how to do this look with this finger here. Beep, beep. So what you will need, first you're gonna need some nail polish as your base. I chose the white as you can see. However, you can be cool and do like hot pink or purple. You can mix it up, but we're gonna be doing white. And then a really good nail polish, clear nail polish. So this one's my favorite one. It's really good because it's actually made for nail art. And it, you can use it as a base coat and a top coat. So this stuff really makes everything stay really well and it helps your manicure last longer. This I actually got from Sally's. So next, I'm using the Sally Hansen nail stickers. There's a lot, there's some other nail stickers out there, but if you've seen my other um, videos, especially my everyday makeup video, check that out. I have these on in the video. And one thing about them is it comes with a bunch of different sizes, so usually I don't obviously fit every size, especially these big old thumb ones. They never really fit my fingers. So when the extra ones, I like to do a look, as you see here, in order to use up all your stickers that you bought. So what you'll also need are some scissors. And in order to begin, just take like the thumb one, if you like, that's the one that didn't fit you. And then you're gonna take off this, the clear part on the front and then the white part on the back of it. And then you're gonna go ahead and just make some strips with your scissors. So you can control how thick you want the tips to be, but you just wanna make a bunch of strips like you see here. And then you wanna take the strip, I already did this one in advance. Um, I wanted mine a little bit thinner than thick, so again, it's up to you what how thick you want your tips to be. And then you're going to just kind of take it and measure how far across to cut it. So first I'm just going to snap it in half because um, you know my finger is pretty small anyway and then I'm going to go in from that. So I snap that strip in half and then I'm going to measure it. So I'm going to snip off right about here with my scissors. Boop. Okay. So next you're going to take your lovely, uh oh stuck to the paper. You're gonna take your lovely um, top coat, I mean your base, clear base. And anyways, before you do this, of course, I put this on as my base nail polish. Then I put on my white and I let it dry. You wanna make sure you let it dry, of course. Now we're gonna do the actual application. Now, yes, this is a sticker already, so it's going to stick to your nail, but just to give it an extra grip, I like to do this anyway. So I'm applying the clear nail polish at the tip of my finger, and I need to pick this up again. Hee. If you want, you can grab some tweezers to help you grab it if you have a hard time picking this stuff up, because um, it's so tiny. But uh, here we go. So, bam, got this finally in my hand. Now I am going to put it here and press it along the nail, and then you just adjust it to fit at the tip properly, like so. And this is why you want to definitely make sure your nails are dry already. Bam, we have a leopard print tip. And then lastly, you're going to take your nail polish and do a final top coat on top. And that is it. You have your long wearing nice nails. And then also just to show you, if you're looking for some nice summer hand, or hand pieces period, they're really cute in the summer. <laughs> For with my nails, um, I'm going to give the link to this. This one's by Magnolia. It's a really cute shop, magnolia.com. So thanks guys for watching and stay tuned to some more videos with Bee Beauty Marked.